Hey guys, it's Daisy and today I'm gonna do an updated class setup for you guys. The last time I did one, I forgot, I think it was when this game first came out. But since then I've changed some of the guns I prefer to use. So today I'm gonna show you the first one that I use the most now. It's not the bell anymore, it's the ASM-1 Magnitude and... I couldn't show you guys stuff before because I just prestiged and everything so I didn't have anything unlocked. But now I have stuff unlocked for it. So what I use is the foregrip, parabolic microphone, and quick draw grip. Because otherwise I can't win gunfights if I don't have quick draw. Parabolic mic of course so you can see people on the radar who have suppressor on. And foregrip because obviously just so you can be more accurate. And then I still use low profile, blind eye, toughness, blast suppressor, and for score streak system hack with, um, for this one I have assist points. I use remote turret uh, as a sentry and warbird defender. I was, I was really wrong about the warbird at the beginning, like the control warbird, I don't really like it. I actually like the defender, it does way more than you actually controlling it and I don't have to worry about it. So my second preferred weapon is still the Bell, but like I said, it's not my first. The ASM-1 is my first, but the Bell 27 is my second preferred. And I have foregrip and parabolic mic on it. I don't think I unlocked foregrip yet for it, or did I? No. I mean quick draw. I haven't unlocked quick draw for it yet, but I would put quick, quick draw if I had it unlocked. I use basically the same things for almost all my classes. Low profile, blind eye, toughness, blast suppressor. For this one, I have exo shield, which I meant to put cloak. And I don't really need that. So I might as well change that now. I don't know what else to put on this. I don't really use none of that stuff. I don't use red dot. For me, red dot, I don't know. Red dot makes me less accurate for some reason. I don't know why. For this one, though, I have orbital care package with... Um, the trap because I, I i just can't stand when somebody steals my care package like it just pisses me off so much so i put the trap on it i have system hack and then i have warbird again defender then i use the kf5 sometimes it's a really good gun too for close range and it depends on the map sometimes i use this but i use advanced rifling for kf5 because like i said it's good for close range but long range it's not really that good so i use advanced rifling and foregrip and then for this one, I actually use Lightweight, Blind Eye, Toughness, Blast Suppressor, um, System Hack again, Remote Turret, but Sentry, and Warbird Defender. And then I have a Stun Grenade, which I don't know if I should even have that here. I might just change that. I don't know. I don't even know. I don't even use that Stun Grenade ever. I forget. And I have the Elite Weapons for the KF5 Breakneck. Um, and I switch two in between. I also have Elite asm1 strider with almost the same stuff from um the other class and uh this one is a, a the arx and i've been using this every now and then it's not my preferred or my favorite but i just like switching between like it's like experimenting with different weapons i've also been experimenting with the sn6 with the elite weapon because i just got this in a supply drop and i was like let me just test it out since it's elite it must be better but i, I think it's pretty good actually um especially for close range too and of course i have exo shield which i always i never use exo shield i rather have cloak on it and uh semtex maybe and warbird defender <laughs> remote turret sentry UAV, I forget to change that. I just system hack instead. And for this one, I do use red dot because I don't know. For this one, is red dot is good for me and foregrip. I have foregrip in almost all my weapons because my accuracy isn't really the best. Like I, I, I have trouble with my accuracy sometimes. So I don't know, especially on this game with all the jumping and stuff. And this one I've been using too a little bit. I've just been trying so hard to unlock the quick draw on this one i need four more headshots to unlock quick draw um but it's it's good i guess it depends who you're playing and the map you're playing on it's basically the laser gun but i have the elite um polar vortex which is pretty good it's like a green laser beam instead of the red one and i have low profile blind eye the same thing blah 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 system hack remote turret warbird defender and <laughs> 
I have the AK-12, which I rarely use, but it's very, very accurate for a long range. But I just haven't unlocked any attachments for it yet. Otherwise, I would have, again, foregrip, quick draw, and probably I would put extended mags on this one. And last but not least, wait, let me see. Yeah, pretty much I already sold you all these. Well, last but not least, it's the S12. This is just yesterday I just switched this one. Just because it, sometimes I'm playing lobbies and there's people who use shotguns, so it pisses me off. So then I'm like, you know what? Let me make a shotgun class too so I can use it against them too. But I haven't used this one yet, so I don't know how good the shotgun is. But I'm going to give it a try. This is basically I have like two classes where I switch weapons all the time. Just to experiment different ones. So right now I haven't used the shotgun, but I'm planning to use it in the future. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this updated class setup. And just uh, leave suggestions on what else you want to see in Advanced Warfare. Anyways guys, hope you, hope you have a good day. And Come and get it.